651, 39 degrees. It's Monday morning, folks. Our Teacher of the Week has been in the classroom molding minds for the past 27 years. Tor Dorothea Colbert is a math teacher at Mears Middle School and says even though she's been teaching for a while, every day brings something new. My go-to points. Plotting points from A to B. Negative two, negative one. These students aren't just learning algebra, but problem solving 101. It's not that they're going to be doing algebra for the rest of their lives. It's that they need to become good problem solvers. And we need good problem solvers. But I also want them to understand that if they persevere, that if they come to a hard problem, they just need to work through it and they can solve it. I want you to Double check your work right there. Mrs. Colbert's motto is to make mistakes. You're not actually working it out right here. She says trial and error is actually good for them. Even when they make mistakes, their brain is actually growing. You actually grow when you're making mistakes. So that's a powerful thing. That's a good thing. And something her students are picking up quickly. No one's perfect and m making mistakes just means you're trying. Did you enjoy math before taking Miss Colbert's class? Um, it was okay. I mean, it wasn't my favorite, but um, as soon as I went into a class, like the first first two days I was like I think I'm gonna like this class so it's pretty fun in there. Well I had a few friends that said that she was super cool and she taught really well. All right yesterday we talked about slope rise over run. Mrs. Colbert's success in the classroom isn't just being noticed by these students and their peers but parents and colleagues too. She's not only our teacher of the week she's a BP teacher of excellence among other notable mentions. You have a picture with President Obama yes. up there. What's that all about? I won the presidential award for excellence in mathematics and I got to go to DC and meet the president. A meet and greet with President Obama. It's quite the honor, but not what she says matters most. What I love about the BP Award and Teacher of the Week is that students or parents nominate me, mm -hmm. and that makes me feel amazing that students would take the time to nominate me. It feels really good. Why am I choosing the points that I do? A good teacher helping her students athlete. find the answers one math lesson at a time. After class, I presented Mrs. Colbert her Teacher of the Week certificate. If her students have questions, she encourages them to problem solve. They look in their notes first, then ask a friend. If they still don't know the answer, then they'll ask her for help. And the making mistakes and having your mind grow, she says she there's research out there. It's called growth mindset and that your brain actually expands once you, you know, make a mistake and, and learn the right answer. It's pretty interesting. Yeah, I joked I should be pretty smart. Pretty super smart. <laughs> yeah. That Mirror Lake Middle School, let me tell you, they have a, they have a lot to be proud, proud of when mm -hmm. it comes to their teachers. Well, if you know an educator going above and beyond in the classroom, make sure to nominate them to be our next Teacher of the Week. You can fill out a nomination form on our Facebook page or by going to ktva.com. It is super simple. It'll just take you a few seconds. And we know that you know someone out there that should be our next Teacher of the Week. Nominate them.